Right. You have a daughter. I spent five minutes with her, mm -hmm. and she's two, three year old. Right. And I realized that within that five minutes, even she knows what's right and what's wrong, and what's the right step to take, what's the wrong step to take. She's aware right. of those senses. Right. Even two, three year old is aware of what's right and wrong, and they take a stand. Mm -hmm. Why are these pathetic religion believers? They are aware that whatever is happening, whatever they're encountering within this earth, within the place they're living, it's wrongdoing, but they're just showing their behind and just it's, ignoring it. It's all ego. It's all, uh, they want to preserve their self-esteem and they want to be in their comfort zone. If they come out of this comfort zone, the society, the fan following people will go against them mm -hmm. and they want to preserve this prestige that's why they have been doing this wrong thing again and again and again even though mm -hmm. they know that's not right they keep doing it mm -hmm. so like you said even three four years old baby is aware of what is right and what is wrong mm -hmm. and sometimes these religious people live their entire hundred years mm -hmm. and then they wouldn't get realized mm -hmm. saying oh at the end of the life when they're in their deathbed that's the time flashback happens okay why you would want to wait 100 years in your deathbed mm -hmm. to get realized instead of now living in the moment mm -hmm. and then be the way you are. Mm. See, these people are so driven by uh, religious fact. That's why I would urge them mm -hmm. to find globally accepted way of self-realization, self-awareness, and become aware of our surroundings. Okay.